Are you calling? Yes, Madam Speaker. I call Gwen Paralag. Madam Speaker, I'm feeling a wee bit tired. Earlier this year, I became quite disillusioned with the elected leaders of New Zealand, particularly with the responses, responses against the school strike for climate movement and the announcement of the Zero Carbon Bill, which falls short of the change required for our country to meet the targets and requirements of the Paris Agreement. I found solace and comfort knowing I was backed by the youth across the country. Today, I'm feeling disillusioned with my own generation. Learning that a large number of members will be voting against Sustainable Energy Bill, which encourages sustainable energy usage and reduces emissions in New Zealand. And I'm not naive. I acknowledge that as it stands, the Sustainable Energy Bill has underwhelming ambitions and it is our moral obligation to go further, holding ourselves accountable by declaring a climate emergency. Yeah. That said, it is incredibly discouraging to know some members can't find it in themselves to support this climate action legislation, particularly in the context of youth parliament, where our actions and decisions are tokenistically used by our respective parties in the media to communicate what we think are the most pressing issues. Passing this bill is a statement that we see sustainable energy and climate change legis legislation as a need and necessity for the betterment of our society. We are constantly described as change makers, risk takers, and trailblazers. Your vote today will be the judge of your character. Therefore, Madam Speaker, I commend this bill to the House. Actually, it isn't a judge of my character, so you don't bring the Speaker into, into it. It's one of the funny things in the House that you address the Speaker, but you don't talk to the Speaker. Do you understand? Okay. Okay. Madam Speaker. Matt Poser. Yeah. Thank you, Madam Speaker. Ladies and gentlemen of the House. I